Binance coin on the daily chart, pull back over here. We're looking for some recent support, looking at the history of this chart, looking for other pullbacks of similar dollar amount. This there is set out for me. I'm going to start to map it out using my trend based pivot extension, clicking from a pivot high, pivot low, pivot high. Once again, over here as well, I have another pivot high, pivot low, pivot high. So that's two price relationships, two pullbacks that are very similar to this one in dollar amount. I can also use my Fibonacci retracements, clicking from this pivot low to pivot high. When I make this pull, we do have the 50% retracement that also overlaps one of the symmetry support work that I just did. Now I can also do another pull from this pivot low to pivot high. When I make this pull, we do have a 618 retracement. So there are multiple symmetry supports and multiple Fibonacci retracements that are matching up in that general area of pullback. Now jumping over on the hourly chart, I'm going to start to remove these real quick. I want to make sure where's price trading at in relation to that 200 moving average. You can see right now, it's working its way back up above that 200 moving average. If you want to add on to more Binance coin, you want to make sure there's strength coming into that bar, getting up above. If that happens, what you can do, not financial advice, you can position size correctly and set your stop below this pivot low. If you'd like to learn how to find high probability setups using Fibonacci analysis, check out my course in the descriptions below. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, subscribe now, hit that notification button. We go over cryptocurrencies as well as US equities. Love to hear from you in the comments area and I'll talk to you soon.